Hey guys, Michelle Grigsby from Kansas City. I am on day 17 of my 90 day video vlog challenge. I'm riding my bike and here's part of the view. This is just part of the ride that I take. Here's my bike. I don't know if you can see my bike. But today I want to share with you, I want to make my blog, my video blog, a lot shorter just because I want to be able to provide things of value and not have people, you know, be stuck watching a video for a long time. So today I just want to really quickly share with you the value and what I, what I may tell you may just help improve your business drastically. I just want to share with you the concept of bike riding. And what's really cool is, you know, when I'm going up the hill, there's times and over when I first start out, it's relatively flat and it's a pretty easy ride. And I liken that to maybe just starting to get involved. Obviously, you know, making the decision to get involved in something, buying the equipment. So, you know, I've got my hat, my glasses, my gloves, my monitor. I'm not wearing my heart rate monitor today, but, you know, the bike. And then actually getting on the bike and just going, just taking action. And what's, what that likens to is just taking action, right? You're just riding on level ground. Then, like now, I'm going up a hill. And this hill is so steep that you could literally walk faster than me pedaling. But I made the commitment, this is actually the first time I've ever stopped on this hill because I want to shoot this video with this beautiful background. But I liken that to, um, yeah, I made the commitment that I was not going to stop. And what a lot of people do is they stop, they rest, and then they continue on. And how that can hurt you is, you know, in with cycling, you don't want to stop. You want to... You want to keep going no matter how hard it is and then once you get to the top you don't want to stop when you get to the top because a lot of times when you get to the top is when the fatigue catches up to you keep going because if you stop you're not going to enjoy all the cardiovascular benefits of, um, of your bike riding and then what happens and I liken that to in internet marketing where that's a learning curve you might be really confused you might be wanting to give up and you got bugs flying in your face you've got rocks that you're climb you know riding over you've got cars going around you and you've got a flat tire or whatever you know and that's just like internet marketing you've got obstacles then when you get to the top guess what happens you get to go down and guess what you get to do you get to ride that you get to enjoy the momentum and a lot of times too when you're on a long ride and you decide to, to uh, do something for the long haul for example I'm taking an hour a day and I'm learning how to do video marketing so by the end of 30 days I'm going to be an expert and it's kind of like the, a lot of riders have this stuff they shoot in their mouth called goo I believe it's what it's called GU and the banana flavor is really good by the way and uh, they, uh, it gives them an extra burst of energy. You could liken that to, say, like doing a solo ad or a co-op or something that gives you a little bit of oomph, that gets you some leads. Um, but, you know, I will tell you, I ride these for the beautiful scenery as well as it's fun riding down those hills when you're able to rest and recoup and then you get your energy back. So, anyway, I just wanted to liken that to cycling to internet marketing and I hope you enjoyed this and I promise my videos will be a lot shorter and um, I want to keep them under a minute to two minutes so but if you did watch this and you enjoyed it please do me a favor and just click like or leave a comment I would really appreciate it and you are so meant for greatness and I will see you tomorrow bye bye